I was impressed with that move you pulled. Bang. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, it's me, it's G, it's DMC, the undefeated, undisputed YouTube champion. That's right, it's the Maverick, Mark Daniels. And we're here with a boss fight for the Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. I think this time around we'll go with an uh, mono AGL team. I have been in this event before with a mono villains team. That's all I've done so far on this. So this will be a trial run. And uh, hopefully this works out for us. We'll grab a, obviously, Super Vegito. And let's see. Swap this team out. If you're wondering why I had some of those uh, cards on my team. I was doing the rank mission 21-3 for high EXP and 21-3 uh, or 23-1. Anyways, you know the mission, the one with the uh, best spot for the gems. And I was leveling up cards while also uh, collecting gems because it's, it's easy enough to do. So let's see here. We, uh, I don't know why. <laughs> Bad habit. I was leveling up all my cards that I got over today's summonings. Okay, let's take a look at our UR. Let's go to AGL. Let us go this guy, that guy, this guy. We'll grab you. We'll grab. I would love to use Vegeta. I mean, we could throw him in there just for the heck of it. Uh, let's throw in. There you are. I was looking for you. And for the key supports. What are your stats looking like? I got him at SA10 because I do have. Spoiler alert, I probably should have said something beforehand. But in my summoning videos, I summoned four of this guy. He has three dude paths unlocked. Uh, he doesn't really have any ore placements. I don't have a whole lot of agility orbs. But I'll get some in there eventually. Screw it, we'll use him. I, I think he'll be fine, right? Compared to someone else, I mean... Sure. Otherwise, I'd probably take God Q or Super Saiyan 3, Goku. So this will be the team we'll run. I think items were fine on. Yeah, those are fine. Let's jump into it, guys. So this is the Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta boss fight. We're doing a mono AGL team. I have not used a mono AGL team against them yet. So this will be interesting. I'm going to try to do every single uh, mono type on this guy as well as villains. Maybe heroes. Although my, uh, again, spoiler alert. Definitely check out the summary videos if you haven't. They were hype. They were absolutely hype. Uh, I pulled the Super Saiyan Blue Vegito. Finally, I pulled two of them actually, but he's not SA10. I don't have enough Elder Kai's to SA10 all my guys. Right now, I got Vegeta at SA10, and I have in my box currently I have five Elder Kai's with a bunch that I can farm from the Baba Shop, um, and I also have my Baba, not my Baba, but my Elder Kai's summon that I'll do eventually, where I get ten Elder Kai's. So I can definitely get them up there, especially after the World Tournament. I'll have enough to get all three of those guys to SA10. But I had to pick and choose it since uh, Vegeta here is kind of a kind of a baller at this point. Figured I'd pick him. So we're going to start off pretty easy here. We got this here, uh, GT Strength Vegeta. Also, if the audio is not very clear, I mentioned this in one of my summary videos. As you can see here, I'm using my headset, my microphone, and my Elgato use the same cable. I had two cables, one of them went out on me, so I have to get a new cable. Until then, I have to use my gaming headset. The audio doesn't seem to be working too well on the uh, OBS, so it is what it is. And one of my Sony videos was crackling a little bit, so hopefully, while messing with some of the volume settings, we won't have as much of an issue with that. Hopefully not. So we're getting these counters off here. If you're wondering why I'm looking here, it's because uh, that's my computer screen, one of my computer screens, my other computer screen in front of me. And then this one is the one with my OBS on. I'm just making sure it's running okay. Uh, hopefully it's not too laggy. Since I am using an Elgato and I'm Chromecasting through my Android phone, it's it's kind of laggy during fights and stuff. Just a little bit. Hopefully it's not too bad. Hopefully it's uh, manageable here. That's kind of bad. Alright, so... This is going to be one of the tougher ones to deal with. Is obviously the type disadvantage. Taking 26,000 damage already, that's kind of a bummer. Now, my Super Saiyan Blue Goku here, 
he does have a decent amount of investment in the dupe system. I ended up pulling, I think, two dupes of him so far. And at the time, I didn't really have anyone to really invest all of his, a lot of agility orbs into. So he got up to about 60%, I think. My Super Vegito is sitting at about 50%. I don't have any dupes of him yet. My, my Rosé is at 50%. And my androids are about 80%, so they're almost done, actually. So we, we survive at the skin of our teeth there. Mostly because I did not use a defensive item. And we didn't even get them halfway. So this is definitely going to be a tough uh, portion here. Let's go do this. Let's go ahead and heal up. We'll go ahead and use a Whis. Get us some defense here. If you guys have suggestions on what teams you guys want to face, let me know. I'm going to try to beat it with all the mono teams. I'm going to try to avoid using in those mono teams, even though I'm using Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. He's not a way I kind of just want to use him. But I could have used uh, Super Saiyan God, God Goku, the agility one. I could have used the Super Saiyan 3 uh, Goku. The uh, Super Saiyan 2 GT Goku would have been fine. The Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta would have been fine. Any of those units would have been just fine in this place. Um, obviously, I'm not using him as a leader. I'm not using him as a... See, I mean, he hits hard. Even at SA-10, though, it's, it's only 100,000 on this guy. That's not that big of an advantage. So, hopefully, guys, you, you guys enjoy these. Hopefully, this gives you guys kind of a, a template to kind of... If you're having issues or trouble with these events, hopefully, these will help you guys in that venture. I may try to attempt a free-to-play. Don't know if I will. That's going to be very tough to do. I'm, I'm pretty confident it can be done. I just don't know if I really want to go through that, to be honest. I'll swap these around here. So I brought this Gohan and I brought this Brawl Pan just because I wanted some key support. Because some of these guys don't link very well. Uh, like the Super Saiyan Blue Goku here. He has prepared for battle, but he doesn't have shocking speed. And on my agility team, this guy would stop. Actually, most of my guys have prepared for battle. Now, my old agility team didn't. Because um, I used to run like the LR. I could have ran LR androids too. I don't know why I decided not to. Should have. Should have ran the LR androids. They're pretty strong. Uh, maybe next time. <laughs> maybe I'll bring them for the villains team. So I'll do a, I'll do a villains. And I was mentioning earlier, I don't think I actually, uh, actually said it, but I'm going to try to do a Heroes run as well with the uh, Super Saiyan Blue Vegito, even though he is only at SA1. I think I'm pretty confident we can still do it. Okay, so I don't think we need to use any healing items here. He has Strength. Spirit Sword. Yeah, in the future, I definitely plan on uh, trying to get a better system here for recording these videos because this is a little slow, and also it's a little, a little difficult recording with the regular Elgato HD because there is a delay. As well as streaming with it, because there's like a, I don't know, like a five second delay. So it does make things a little tough at times. I probably could replace uh, that Gohan with the LR Androids. Even though he does give an attack boost. So he's almost better than Brawl Pan. The only problem is he only gets super types plus 2 key. And uh, I think it's 20. It's either 20 or 25% attack up. Um, so Rose wouldn't get it. And if I use the LR Androids, they would not get it as well. But yeah, this event's not, it's not too hard. It's not too hard at all. Especially if you have units with the uh, potential system investment, like it makes things so much easier. Um, I ran the 
boss rush with my villains team day one it just dropped it took me an hour and like seven minutes i have a screenshot of it uh, but i did beat it with my villains team it took me two tries the first try i got up to the emergency monster fight and i was just so close if i could have got past him i, I definitely could have beat the trunks because of the team that i was running uh, the links are great against future trunks obviously with the uh, the rose the goku black the the merge of Masu. uh let's see what do we want to do here i should probably heal i could use a ghost duster here if i wanted to i think i'm going to use a Whis instead Now the toughest one's probably going to be Strength, using an Omega Shenron. I don't have LR Broly, but I do have Omega Shenron, and uh, and my Omega Shenron is 100%, so he's a monster. Oh yeah, I was talking about the uh, boss rush. But yeah, you could, I mean, these guys, especially the Neo Godlings, make that boss rush so much easier too. Having all that extra HP and defense and attack is just, it's just essential. He hasn't supered me yet. Oh, here it comes. But can I get the counter? This is actually my first time using the Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, so this is pretty cool. I do have him on JP, but I don't play JP that much. And when I got him, it was, it was kind of late in. I got him in the Super 17 banner. Just a yellow summon. On there, I basically just, whatever stones I get, I just kind of yellow them. Versus here, I actually save them and use them strategically. Because um, I don't really care too much, but I just like summoning over there every now and then. Maybe I'll get lucky. Uh, let's see. Let's swap you two around. Alright, we're going to go ahead and heal again. So we've gone through a couple of healing items. We've gone through some support items here. Uh, things aren't going so well for us here. I think we're fine, though. We do have Ghost Usher still to go through. I definitely probably should have replaced one of my support here, one of my key support units, with another hard hitting unit like the Yellow Androids. But I'm pretty confident we can still get this. Our weeks is still in fact here. Um, we might have to use the Ghost Usher next turn. Got that counter attack. But I want to know, guys, how how's your adventure going? You guys getting the medals? You guys... Uh, doing pretty well. How'd your summonings go? Did you guys get what you wanted? Obviously, if you've seen my videos, you know I got exactly what I wanted and everything. Uh, so it was definitely a good day for me. And for those who didn't get what you wanted, hey, you know, I've been there. Trust me. <laughs> uh, we've all been there. And, it, and it's rough. It is, it is rough. But uh, there will be days where it's going to be a lot better for it. always is. And, uh, these guys, they come back in future banners. Arguably even a better banner than the ones we have today. You got the intelligence gogeta banner that would be the banner i would start saving for now especially if you're a free-to-play player um, it's gonna have the super saiyan 4 goku on there super saiyan 3 angel goku obviously intelligence gogeta the uh the rage trunks and the super saiyan blue vegeta so you get to look forward to all those guys on that one banner and it's also a buy three get one free type banner and if if it continues the trend that global's been that global's been following it'll probably be each set, because of the Janema Banner's counter set of it, will be discounted, and then we'll be able to get the uh, buy three get one three on top of that. Plus, who knows, maybe some sort of ticket bonus like we've got with the Rose Vegeta Blue Banner as well as this banner. So that's something to you know definitely look forward to. All right, so we're getting close here. We used our last uh, not our last uh, Ghost Usher, but we used a Ghost Usher last turn, so we can't use it again this turn. Go ahead and use this Dende here. We we're getting really uh, to the end here with their items. But I think we got him. I think we got him. I knew this would be close. Uh, and the more this is, you know, this this battle progresses, I do not know if we can beat this with the strength team. Uh, without LR Broly. With LR Broly, maybe. If I use Super Saiyan 4 Goku lead, I probably can. But if I use an Omega lead without Super Saiyan 4 Goku on the team, I kind of have my doubts about it, if I'm being honest. But I'm pretty confident I could be this with my AGL team, my intelligence team, tech team, and my physical team.
pretty close to a Doken attack here, too. We got him. Okay, so we didn't have to use all our items, just uh, most of them. All but one. Alright, so we beat him with the agility team, guys. So that's it. That's the agility team there. We did have the Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta on our team. But again, he didn't really do too much for us. He was just kind of there. Good links, though. Great links. But uh, I could have replaced him with someone else. It would have been just fine. So hopefully, if you guys have a Mono AGL team, that's kind of how you plan to beat this event. This will give you some hope for that because it is very possible to do. Um, but anyways, guys, next video will probably be the tech video, so look forward to that. Again, I plan on trying. I will try with the strength team regardless of how I think it's going to end up. Um, you know, maybe I'll try that before, like, the physical boss fight. And then I'll say, well, I tried the strength one, guys. It didn't work out. And then I'll let you guys know that. But anyways, guys, until next time, I am the Maverick. Peace. And one love.